Liverpool's transfer window may have closed, but there are a few intriguing caveats to consider. Firstly, the Saudi Pro League clubs still have until Thursday to make signings, and Mohamed Salah's future remains a topic of interest, despite Liverpool's insistence that he's staying. A substantial offer could potentially tempt the club, raising questions about the price and whether such a move is in the cards. Looking ahead, Liverpool will have to wait until January to make further signings. However, this may not hinder their pursuit of success this season. The Europa League draw has been favorable, providing opportunities to rotate the squad while aiming to top the group and avoid early knockout rounds. Domestic cup competitions may not require a strong lineup until January, offering young talents valuable minutes. The absence of the Champions League allows key players like Salah and Virgil van Dijk to manage their minutes, focusing primarily on the Premier League. In January, Liverpool can dip into the winter market, potentially addressing positions like centre-back and holding midfield. Names like Arthur Theat and Piero Hinkapai were linked to Liverpool during the summer, suggesting a keen interest in bolstering the defence. Furthermore, there are expectations of Liverpool making a move for Fluminense midfielder Andre Trindade in January, once his club is more willing to let him leave. While Liverpool had a solid summer transfer window, there are still gaps to fill, particularly in the centre-back and holding midfield positions. Addressing these areas could significantly enhance Klopp's squad. In the meantime, the absence of Champions League commitments allows Liverpool's top talents to focus solely on the Premier League, potentially positioning themselves for a title challenge and successful cup runs. Till I get up. So